Hello, welcome to Wise Guys. This is a divisibility test and its application for 15. So let's look at the, what is divisibility test for 15. So if a number is divided by both 3 and 5, the number is divided by 15. Then we can see the key is divided by 5. Because when you look at the last digit, if last digit is 0 and 5, it is divided by 5, right? Then just look at if it is not 0, 5, it's absolutely not divided by 5, so you don't need to worry about divided by 50. So let's look at, at the rows numbers. Okay, let's see first by 5. So this is not 5. This yes, 0, 5, 0, 0, 5, 5. So all these numbers except 96 is divided by 5. Then we check if it is divided by 3. So add the digit to see 3. You can add them 3 plus 1 equal 4, 4 plus 5 equal 9. So it's divided by 3. So that's why this 350 is divided by 50. And also when you and more digits you just look at 3 is okay because 3 is divided by 3. And you just look at 1 and 5 is 6. So it's okay, it's multiple of 3. So 340 is divided by 5, but 3 per 4 is 7 is not. So it's not divided by 50. So this number, 5, 5, 10, 18, right, is divided by 3. So this number divided by 50. This number, 6 per 9 is 50, is divided by 3. So that's why divided by 50. 8,340, add all the digits. 3 plus 4 is 7 plus 8 is 15, is working with 3. So that's why it's working with 50. Next is 9 is multiple of 3. 7 plus 2 is multiple of 3 is 9. The 5 is not. So this number is not working with 3. That's why it's not working with 50 as well. The last one, 6, 9, 3, and 3. And 4 plus 5 is 9 is working. So, is working. So, sometimes it's more digit, you don't need to add one by one. Just to check each digit or two digit. If it is multiple of 3, is okay. So, this number is divided by 15. This one is divided by 15. This one, and this one, and this one. Okay? So, it's not even very easy, hey? Okay, let's do application predict the remainder. So first of all, let's see predict the remainder. Also, we need to check the last digit has to be divided by 5. The 0 is working, divided by 5, but 3 plus 4 is 7 is not divided by 3. So when we backward, we still need to back to the last it is 5 or 0. So first back to 5, we got 335, right? 335 is divided by 5, but add the digit, 335 is not working. So this is not working. So we need to back again to 330. Because this last digit is 0, is working with 15. And 3 plus 3 is 6, and this is working with 3. So that's why 330 is divided by 15. So the remainder, 40 minus 30, is 10. 
this number is divided by 5, but the, you look at the 363, three, you know the 5 is not multiple of 3. So we need to back to 3630. So this number is divided by 5 and also divided by 3. 363. Three. So this number is working. So the remainder is 5. Next is we need to back to 25, right? First 70, 97, 25. We need to back to 25 to make it divided by 5. But we add 9. 7 plus 2 is 9. Another 9. So 5 is not. So this is not working. We need to back to 97, 20. And this is the last digit is 0. It's divided by 5. And also, this is 9. 7 plus 2 is 9. So this number is divided by 3. So that's working, divided by 50. So 7 minus 0, the remainder is 7. Last one. 52, 52, 52, divided by 50. So make it divided by 5. We need to make 52, 52, 50. This number is divided by 5, but we add all the digits. We have 3, 5, which is 15, is a multiple of 3, because these two is not. Add together is 4, is not multiple of 3. So this is not working. We're back again, 52, 52, 45. And then you can see 3, 5, make multiple of 3, 2, and 2, 4 is not working because 2 per 2 is 4, 4 per 4 is 8, is not working. In the back again to 52, 52, 40. And this number, let's see, 5 plus 5 is 10, 10 plus 2 is 12, the 12 is multiply of 3. And 2 plus 4, 6 is a multiple of 3. So this um, uh, is divided by 5 and 3. So it is working. So 52 minus 40, the remainder is 12. So this is presented by wife guide. But if you need more practice, you can go to Ming's house, blogs.rc.ca slash Ming. Basic Math Divisibility Test Worksheet. Have a nice day.